We're here at the local cricket club of Threkeld in Cumbria to launch the UK's first live trial of 4G technology. We are the most remote, sparsely populated constituency in the whole of England, and our problems are problems of distance. 4G technology allows us to break those barriers of distance in services and in business. I don't think you can learn effectively in the 21st century without taking advantage of new technology. Our young people are digital natives. They're at home on the net. That's how they learn. And I think unless you can ensure that they have the best possible technology, you're not going to get the best out of them. The trial goes live today. There's a website for the local community to access, to sign up. The police, the mountain rescue, the local schools will all be part of this trial so that we can all make the most of this new technology. Our download speeds are uh, roughly eight times faster than 3G. If you go back to the flooding we had in 2009, which devastated the county, at that time a lot of local infrastructure was down. Having something like 4G available to us uh, to be able to communicate, uh, to, to give people information, to help them, let them know when they can go back into their homes, let them know where the danger points were and how they can uh, seek help would have been ideal. We cover the county of Cumbria, it's um, 2,400 square miles. We have 12 emergency vehicles on the road with doctors and drivers. We're a very IT-led service, therefore speed, fast broadband, is very important to us. Threckheld is a great example of a rural location that has not benefited from most modern technology always. We want to learn and understand how consumers, the community and local businesses can really benefit from the 4G technology. I feel that Cumbria can be at the cutting edge. 4G technology coming here first allows us to get ahead allows us to prove that the most sparsely populated rural parts of the country can be leaders, can show what we can do in business and services, can compete with the rest of the world and can make this a really prosperous place as well as of course a very beautiful place.